display coming mm -hmm. up in a little bit. So Some cool. really cool our end tables, which you might see that look like drums. Yes. Those are coming up. But let's start with these charming figures that are so cool because they have this little hidden secret to yes, them. Yes, they do. Real quickly, you have three choices here. Mm -hmm. We have your Santa. We have an angel, which you'll see next to that. There she is. Isn't she pretty? All in red and gold. And then down there at the end, we have a snowman. So these are um, like cold cast porcelain or resin figurines, mm -hmm. right? right? They stand, and just so you know, in terms of their height, they're around 11 inches mm -hmm. tall. They look like they were hand carved, Yes, Nancy. they do. Mm -hmm. So tell me a little bit about them. So Plow and Hearth has created these, and they did design these with the little secret I'll show you here in just a second. But they wanted it to give that, that look that has like its rough cut. So I'm going to turn our snowman around just so that you can see what we're talking about. Looks like rough cut wood here. You know, so many times resin figures are just really smooth. Like you said, sort of have that porcelain look. Yes. But Plow and Hearth wanted it to look like you went to that craft show and you found the fellow who was sitting there doing his carving with his knife and then created this darling little snowman. But there's something special here. And as you come down, you're seeing all the beautiful details on his jacket. You've got the like um, holly right there with gold berries. Look at this gorgeous poinsettia right in there. And as we come down, a little surprise, Plow and Hearth created these with a drawer. And this is a functional drawer. So if you want to put a little trinket in there, maybe a piece of jewelry or a little note to a loved one, you certainly can use this almost like a very special gift box. Yes, I love mm -hmm. that idea. So you saw all the detail on the snowman. Oh, um, our angel. Now look at this <gasps> angel and so many Isn't of your angel collectors. Yes, yes. So again, I don't think I've ever seen one done so beautifully in just like reds and golds. Yes, I love that. Now her her color is a little bit more red, Christmas red, where the snowman and the Santa are more burgundy, just so that you know the difference if you're trying to color match. I love what Plow and Hearth did inside the wings. Look at this, the beautiful treatment with the gold right there, and then she's praying and or you know contemplating she's got a very serene look on her face and coming down the brocade on her dress there's a poinsettia right there and then her drawer is right down here mm. and so each one has a working drawer does it have like a stop there nancy yes there keeps is the drawer from mm -hmm. completely pulling out it does cool. it does i'm glad you asked that and then we have santa. our santa Aww. jolly santa love santa he has just a beautiful face yeah they Plow and Hearth does such a great job with faces and they're creating that warmth and welcome in your home, something that is unique and different because Plow and Hearth created these with the drawers, nobody else has them. So there you're seeing that he has the star in his hand and that's actually removable. It's okay. something that comes, let's see if I can get that off. It comes in the drawer okay. and then the snowman has the cardinal Okay. and the wing hat, the, the, um, Angel has prayers in okay. her drawer, okay. um, but his drawer is right here. And again, it has that stop, but look at all these gorgeous details of the gold, uh, you know, decoration right there, right here. And again, that carved and even just like vines going down here, that rough cut wood look. I would love you to consider this as kind of one of those first, you know, baby's first Christmas Great kind idea. of an item mm -hmm. um, with a note, a handwritten note from you inside of that drawer. Because while the child may not appreciate that at ages one through 16, mm -hmm. um, when it's their first Christmas in their new home as an adult, and That's they bring it idea. out, mm -hmm. and they open up that drawer and have a note in your handwriting, um, whether you're still here or not, I can tell you that the things that I have that my grandmother bought for me mm -hmm. and, and shared with me for holidays that have her handwriting. That's a wonderful idea. I mean, they idea. bring me to mm -hmm. tears every time. Absolutely. You know, I still have her with me mm -hmm. in something that she thought was special to celebrate the holidays. So, mm -hmm. you know, it could even be, you know, a first Holy Communion with that beautiful angel, you know, mm -hmm. um, and she's just so pretty. Or if you're a snowman collector, um, or maybe there's a fun memory of building snowman with your sister or your brother, and you put that in their little drawer and you give it to them as a gift. That's a wonderful um, I idea. Mean, it's, it's really all about being together and making memories together and these pieces help do that. Plus they're really cute yeah. and they, you know, <laughs> you know, kind of give you those smiles on your face as you walk from room to room. Um, Melissa's over on Facebook and she said she'd put her keys in the drawer, oh. which she loses all of the time. 
good idea. You'll always remember that the angel is guarding your keys, or maybe the snowman is guarding your keys. Love right? Yeah, you can leave the snowman out through winter. <laughs> right, exactly. So maybe that'll help you a little bit longer. I know we put these out a couple yeah, of places we did. over here. So, you know, back here at our table, Nancy, like just the, you know, this cute little touch right that just you know fills in that space on it that does. console table exactly or the bookcase or your mantle or mm -hmm. whatever it might be exactly and they're such a nice size at 11 inches tall they just are just perfect they're not too big they're not so small that they get lost among everything else i love the way they're paired right here with our gingerbread house yep. and our little cloche right here they're just a beautiful touch beautiful color and plow and hearth quality plow and hearth makes sure that you have something that's going to be lasting so i love your idea of tucking that note into that drawer yeah. so that you have something that's adorable you're putting that out but then no one knows about that little secret drawer until you tell them about it so this becomes that special gift box or maybe that memory keeper maybe you just add a new note each year or every yeah, couple of years good idea. and you just have something that's collecting and you just are able to bring that out and maybe you just do a special memory each Christmas and you put it in something there you're thankful for that year. yes and then the right? next year when you bring it out you take that out and you read it and you think about it the previous year and then maybe you add a new one for the next year. I was thinking There's so many options. Even the angel, even though she has a little feel of Christmas, mm -hmm. but maybe in your little girl's room that could become the tooth fairy box. Oh, I love it. Wouldn't that be fun? <laughs> That's like right. Perfect place. And she's so beautiful. Um, we also put one up here just so mm -hmm. you can see too. We have these pretty mirrored quatrefoil trays that are available. Um, again, simple, easy decorating. I like to just give you ideas. Mirrored tray, whether it's this one or another one, a little bit of that kind of fake snow. You put your little figure you're on there. It's done. darling. Yes, it's exactly. Done. Easy and decorating great. and beautiful. Yes. Um, you're going to be back with some more things. I am. Yeah. That great, great sleigh that you might see there is right. coming up. Our drum tables, those are going to be coming up. So some great things from Plow mm -hmm. and Hearth still ahead on your home with Jill. Thanks for stopping by, Nancy. Thank we'll you, see you, Jill. In see you in just a bit. All right.